Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing some Don't Starve with RT again. This is a sponsored video, it's sponsored by Clay. It was actually live streamed over on RT's channel, so he's gonna do the intro, give me a little bit of a break, but I hope you enjoy. How is it going though, folks? Uh, you're all very welcome to the YouTube video. Uh, I'm joined by uh, Kevin once again today. Uh, we're gonna be playing some Don't Starve Together. Uh, Clay has sponsored us once again to be playing the game. Uh, they, they were quite impressed with uh, Kevin's handiwork the last time of burning literally everything. You've got your work cut out for you, dude. <laughs> the, the thing is, falling off that, um, because we're sponsored to play this game again, and it's tying into a new update that they've put out for the game that is based on the character you played last time, Willow. The changes that they have made for her, and this is right up your alley, and I think this is honestly made for you, Kevin, they made her immune to fire. <laughs> oh. And they made it so that she can interact with fire a lot more, which just seems like a terrible idea. Seems like a great idea. But what I'm set up here is we're going to be playing Lights Out Game World, and this is basically a dark world. Uh, this world has no day, so you have to light stuff on fire to not die. As if we didn't struggle enough the last time. <laughs> You're like, let's make it harder <laughs> and make Kevin more of a nuisance. So what should I do in this dark world? What's my um, primary objective? Okay, I see you've already set everything on fire over there. We actually do need to be <laughs> kind of careful what we burn, because if we run out of stuff to burn, we will just die. Oh my god, what have you done up here? Well, I, I needed to see. I was I was trying to... Uh, what the hell? This is ridiculous. You're being feckin' reckless. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I've made them angry. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with them? You will die if you set the fishmen on fire. I didn't know they were fishmen. I thought they were pigmen. I thought I was picking on the weak, not the strong. Yeah, I'm gonna put away the lighter. I'm not gonna light anything on fire for a solid 15 minutes. Whoops. Go to the tree. Jesus. I made my pledge, I can't help it. The one talent I have, lighting stuff on fire, and now I won't do it, even though I need it. <laughs> that was why I chose this world setup. I thought it would be better suited for you. I've become a pacifist. I think I'm dying. I'm dead. <laughs> what just killed me? Due to my peaceful nature, it became apparent that maybe the dark world wasn't for us. I'm just not a violent guy. I don't support arson, so this world wasn't for me. So we went back to a normal world. Yes, yeah, so this is where we left things off last time. Oh, the tree guard is still alive. Yeah, but I'm gonna take care of them. I have a plan. Uh, whenever you're here with that plan, because, like, he's kind of just looking at me. I'm on the way. The tree actually doesn't seem that hostile at the moment. Like, he seems friendly. I'll make him feckin' hostile. Come here, you little shit. No! Oh, man, wait till the Industrial Revolution takes over and you will be fecked. You trees will be just wiped off the earth. Ah! Jesus Christ, there's pelicans everywhere. Are those penguins or pelicans or what are they? Oh god, yeah, it's winter, so it's probably penguins. What's the problem? Out of sight, out of mind. The problem is dealt with. Ah, look who's come to rest his head by the fire. Can you get him away from my meatballs? Uh, I can try, but I think he might be hungry. He's very slow, to be fair. Look at him, he's stuck. Oh, we got him now. Here, actually, wait, wait, wait. St stand there a moment or two. I've got a plan. Hang on. Okay, you gonna blow him up? No, I'm gonna build a small wall around him. Oh, he can be like our pet. Okay, uh, can you just like run around him in like kind of a circle or something? Da, 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 da. Oh, and he's out. <laughs> ah, bollocks. Is there any other structure I could make to like box him? In. Do you have any grass on you? Uh, no, I have pine cones and charcoal. That's all I'm carrying along with my axe. Neither of those are helpful. <laughs> oh, wait, he settled. You planting the pine cones helped. Haha, <laughs> I'm a genius. Why don't we chop him down? No, you can't chop him down. Like, he's just, he's just here to stay. Freeloading. Oh, you little shit. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Look at him. He's so fucking smug. <laughs> well, there is a nice fire here whenever you want to come home. All right. If I freeze to death, you got to come help me, though. I'm going to make you one of these two just so you don't die as much. I won't die at all. That's a nice thought. <laughs> I'm gonna name the tree Rocket Raccoon. Yeah, I've always said it today with Groot, but I think Rocket's a better name. Uh, I'm going insane again. Ah! Uh, oh, drop Bernie. Do you have Bernie? Uh, no, I have nothing. <laughs> Look for the teddy bear. Now, once you find the teddy bear, just check you have all the ingredients you need. I have no ingredients. I only have pine cones. Rocket, spring into life. Defend your papa. <laughs> Oh, did you take a swing at him? See? He loves me, which is why he's coming over to hug me, right? Oh, God, it's going dark. No, 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 no. Like, I, I don't have anything. Uh, me neither. I think I'm dead. Oh, I can't believe you died again. You can't believe it? I can believe it. <laughs> you see, through my death, others live. 
it's kind of poetic in a way. It is true, actually, yeah. If I didn't find your ghost there, I would have died. Okay, just stay close to me. <laughs> I'll, like, do a little bit of moving to make it fun. I don't want to make it too easy. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, it's daytime. Oh, my son. <laughs> oh, is he chasing me now? No, no, he's he's not. He wouldn't do that. Why is Rocket leaving? I knew he was always sick of us, but I guess he's sick of more all of a sudden. <laughs> Pay $10 to uh, keep Kevin alive. He will die without financial aid. <laughs> it's like one of those depressing ads. Everything's shot in black and white. I'm just like sitting in my kitchen. <laughs> Only $40 could keep this Kevin alive. I can't get the grass now because this thing's chasing me. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Okay, the pig spooked it. What the hell? Oh god, I haunted it and made it angrier. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, I need heat. I need heat. Ah, oh, plenty of heat here. I don't even know how I'm supposed to get you back alive this time because I'm so badly injured. I don't know. Life usually finds a way. We always thrive in the end. Yeah, but there's not much life here, Kevin. Oh, those things look lively. <laughs> oh, God. I'm dead. You died. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> if 50 seconds to try, find a touchstone. What do they look like? Uh, it's like kind of like a black slab on the ground. Oh, that's it. I'll miss my son. All right. Well, on the bright side, I have a lighter again. I can't put out... I just have to wait for that big boy to burn. Why do you want to put it out? I just don't want it all to burn, Kevin. You want it to not burn, but I need it to burn. <laughs> so what's really important here? I'm gathering food for the home. You're setting everything on fire. No, no, no. I'm gathering food. I have two carrots. I have uh, three carrots. Everything's on fire, though, isn't it? Just just be honest with me. <laughs> no, no, no. Every, everything's fine. Everything's going great. <laughs> that means it's on fire because fire is great. No, no, no. Everything, everything is all... All good. Don't come up north, though. I found a suit made out of grass, which is great for a person that plays with fire all the time. <laughs> now you too can burn. <laughs> oh, look, more food. Better get this for the group so that we can stay alive. See, I'm just worried because you're being so helpful and considerate right now. And I don't know what's wrong. God, should we just set up camp here then? Because like this seems just like a lovely little place. I personally love it. It's probably the best spot I've ever seen in my life. Oh, wait, wait, where'd you go? Are you on the road? Uh, I'm lost. Wait. Oh, ah, there's a turkey. I know he's in this but That's it. Come out. Should I just keep my lighter out or should I suppose I should light up a tree? But you could make a campfire too. Ah, uh, too complicated. <laughs> look at this. Look at all these bushes. Here I go. Oh, don't burn them. Don't picking burn them. the bushes of their berries for sustenance for me and my friend. I found the graveyard. Like, yeah, there's actually a lot of food here. This world is much kinder to us, I feel. I think it's just the positive attitude we're having. My god, I just found the rock biome. Yeah, see, everything's looking up. We actually have a chance here. What the hell is this thing? Suspicious marble. I'm taking you home. Just bring it home. Oh, it's gonna take a while. We need that boulder. You don't need a spine. Oh my god. We got the best world ever. Uh, what did you find, Kevin? I found the big birds with the big eyes that lay eggs that we can steal. You're gonna get your kid back again. <laughs> yeah, there's no egg in sight at the moment, though. I'm gonna scope it out his nest and there's nothing there. We need to find another bird person so we could like repopulate or we could just kill him and make the species go extinct no but then we don't get the eggs i do want to eat his kids i think this is going to be a long-term project to get this back bring it home or you're not welcome home okay there's like two large marble pieces like that and you can put them together but i've never actually done it i don't know what it does uh but if you find the other marble piece you're welcome to bring that home too <laughs> Gladly. Oh god, no, it's chasing me. Why did you upset him? I was just trying to steal its gold. Never steal a tall man's gold. They're saying don't jinx it. Well, I have news for you guys. If you think this could be jinxed, nothing will go wrong. <laughs> nothing at all could possibly go wrong. I might die here unless I equip this torch. Oh, if I have to save you again, I'm going to be very upset. I just realized I'm starving to death. I was there stuffing carrots in your mouth, not realizing that I was the one that was starving to death. Oh yeah, my, my guy's not even hungry. I'm like an Irish mammy, I just have to feed people. All right, bird person, have you laid an egg yet? Oh my god, there's no egg there. Why do you have to be so unwantable? He's such a loser. <laughs> <laughs> I've almost got the marble back to the base, so then it'll be mission accomplished. Oh, you're still doing that. I thought you were... um getting some resources or something. No, 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 I'm doing important things. We've got to find the other half of that. Uh, it's not really what it's about, though. It's just about having this piece. All right, suspicious marble. I love that it's suspicious. It'll fit right in with us. This is probably the most peaceful we've ever had at playing this game. This is what it's normally like when I uh, play the game. It's starting to sound like I might be the problem. <laughs> You're welcome to help me uh, chop down the trees here. I'm just gathering resources. Okay, thank you very much. 
<laughs> I'm just so happy with our home. I hope Rocket comes back. I don't. I hate Rocket. What? What do you think about my grass suit, huh? Oh, wait, where did Kevin go? Oh my god. Haha, <laughs> I was here all along. I wonder if you'd notice if I snuck around and lit this area on fire. Don't do it. I swear to god. You hiding behind that tree? <laughs> <laughs> I'm invisible. Both of us have our career set up in such a way that like anything we build must also be destroyed. <laughs> I don't really care. As long as I'm ruling over it, I don't mind if I'm ruling over ashes. I have surplus of resources. What you got? You got any fire? No, it's the one resource I don't need more of. He's got an egg, but he's guarding it. Oh, does he have an egg? Okay, I'm coming over. Hang on. I might need a distraction. He's looking right at me with that feckin' eye. Yeah, like, look, feck off. How can he even see? Mm. Like, surely he's not even a threat. He must have, like, no depth perception. How would he actually even be able to hit me? He just sees, like, a static image. Okay, yep, yeah, bait him, bait him. Ah, I'm ah. going for the egg. Ah. Huh. Oh, he's a fast little fecker, isn't he? Okay, I got his child. Okay, he's running away. He gave up fast. He did not want that kid. All right, I want to hatch this one. I'm going to steal his gold real quick, too. Ha <laughs> ha Now he won't be able to buy any more children, I assume, because I don't know how he made it otherwise. We need to put that egg by the fire and hatch it. Yep. What comes out of it? I, I want to know. I gotta know. I think we can get a tall bird baby. I, like, actually have it as a pet. I'll take care of it. I will be the mother hen. Yeah, you gotta, like, just sit on it. Because, like, last time, like, a spider just ran up and ate it. That was on your watch. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just blaming you. <laughs> hey, it's not my child, okay? I'm not responsible if your baby gets eaten. It may be my child, but you stole it. <laughs> Legally speaking, <laughs> that means you have to take care of it half the time. Oh god, you can just cook it, like, right off the bat if you have the lighter <laughs> equipped. We're not gonna do that. I love him. Oh, he's hatching! I just touched him, and my love for him brought him out! How is that so quick? Put, put him on the ground again. I thought he might hatch in my pocket, and then the first thing he'd see would be me. I don't want him to see you first. <laughs> Back off! <laughs> Why won't it hurry up? Up, come on. It takes time. I've got things to do. Hurry up. <laughs> I want to raise my child. Dude, you spent nine months in the womb yourself, okay? Yeah, but that was different. That was me. <laughs> I'm allowed to do that. So what do you think we should name it? If, like, if it's a boy or if it's a girl? The Reckoning. I, I don't know how we even tell, like, which gender it is. <laughs> Either way, it could be called The Reckoning. First name, The. Second name, Reckoning. Duh. That's, that's the name of our child. Perfect. Duh. <laughs> And it's great because we can be like super condescending. Like anytime it says something, we can be like, duh. <laughs> and it'll be technically correct. The reckoning is coming. Wait, did you leave down your bear next to him so he has something to play with? No, it's a sacrifice. <laughs> um, Do you have anything that I could eat besides the child? Because otherwise, like it might come down to it's me or him. Um, I'll go get, I'll go All down right. the Tesco. I <laughs> need chocolate. I want to have peas for dinner. I feel like peas tonight. I Hey, peas! <laughs> Let's just throw him off the table. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm gonna attempt to put him close to the fire again, because I think he's getting cold. Nope, he's not getting cold. Okay, he's fine. Where's the baby? He's fine. <laughs> Where's the baby? You didn't love us anymore. Kevin? <laughs> Kevin, I'm serious. <laughs> Destroy the child. It's good. It's all a ritual, dude. It's a sacrifice. How is a baby going to be born and grow up real strong if we don't sacrifice a thing or two? That's what parenting is all about. Sacrifice. Just think of what my parents had to go through. It's not gonna work if you sacrifice the oh, child. Oh fuck, I ate him by accident! <laughs> Shit! Wait, did you eat it there? I ate him by accident! No! My child! Oh my god. The reckoning! You came back with the child and then just ate him in front of me. I don't know what happened, Doc. <laughs> the child is there and then the next minute it just fell into my mouth. I'm so upset but happy at the same time because I think deep down I wanted to eat it, but like I wasn't going to. He thought he was better than me. And that pisses me off. Let there be a warning to anyone in chat. Oh, sorry, I meant to give you food. I kind of just ate most of it, but there you go. It's all right, the child filled me up. <laughs> so I'm not too bad. <laughs> uh, oh, what a great day. I'm, I'm just sad now. Yeah, feels like a little part of me is missing too. But deep down, I think he'll always be inside of us in some way. <laughs> Especially me. <laughs> we had the error again. Did it save since I ate my child? That's a sentence I never thought I'd say. <laughs> The child's alive again. I'm taking it into my custody. I'm coming. <laughs> child's going to live with mom a while. At least let me see him. I need proof he's alive. The child is alive. I'm not going to tell you where I've gone. <laughs> Daniel took the kids. I need to find him. I will burn this whole world down to get the reckoning back. 
Okay, Kevin, where are you at the moment? Um, I'm not actually sure. I got something I want to show you. Is it going to uh, be dangerous? No, it won't be dangerous. And they have to be pretty sweet, um, like honey. Okay, I feel like we're on the uh, the same track here. It's kind of like a hive mind. Oh no, it's not following me. This is why you couldn't raise a child. Dun, 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 dun. I'm going to eat the child. I mean, sorry, I'm just picking it up now. I was just singing a Harry Potter song, dude. Those are the words. I'm picking it up now. Yeah, it's the bee queen. See, he can make children just like that. Why do we find it so difficult? Go get him, child. Dude, they're gonna eat the child. Wait, oh my god. Oh no. You won't eat him. Oh no. I went over to pick it up and then I had my lighter out and it nearly cooked him. <laughs> you doing okay there? I'm doing no, fine. I don't think you are, though. You're always dying on me. Where's the child? Where's the child? Ah, I got the child. <laughs> just so you know, I have no idea how to bring you back. <laughs> Maybe we should just leave it here. <laughs> I think this is a fitting ending. After all your hard work, you end up dying. <laughs> and me and my child live. <laughs> Why does it always end with my death, too? Like, I have to, like, revive you, like, three times. <laughs> No, I think this is canon. I think in the end, you die and me and the child live. Well, the child's not gonna live for long, honestly. <laughs> no, I, I raise it to just hate you. <laughs> You're just stealing my stuff now. Good news, I think um, the egg hatched and our child is out in the world now. Pick up wet goop. What a lovely name you gave him. I love it. All right, there you go, sunny boy. <laughs> uh, no. On the bright side, we kept our child warm. Yeah, we did in the end. So in the end, I'm the lone survivor. I always kind of knew it would end like this. <laughs>